It has been very stormy weather and the school roof is leaking. How can we... How can we raise the... How can we raise... We could have a f <laughs> What's a f It's a day for picnics and giving money to see people run. And the more money you give, the further they run. Good idea, Daddy Pig. How far can you run? What? Uh, well, I can run as far as you like. But, Daddy, you can hardly run at all. Nonsense. I'm an expert at running. Good. Does anyone else want to run? No, no thank you. you. Pepper and her family are eating spaghetti. <laughs> Delicious. Daddy Pig, you've already had three helpings. Eating gives me energy. And I need energy for my fun run. You didn't have to cut me off. Like Bless you. <laughs> <laughs> this is easy. It is easy to run downhill. It is hard to run uphill. You didn't have to cut I don't think I should have eaten so much spaghetti. It is the day. Madame Gazelle has a chart to show how far Daddy Pig must run. If Daddy Pig can run to here... The supermarket. Then to here... My granddad's garage. And all the way to here... Windy Castle. Then we'll have enough money to fix the school roof. I'll do it now. Ready, steady, go! I did it! Now we can have the picnic. <laughs> Silly Daddy. That's just a drawing. Yes. Now you must run to the real Windy Castle. Oh. Ready, steady, go. Hooray! <laughs> Come on, Daddy Pig! You can make it! Let's look through the telescope. I can see Daddy. The telescope makes everything look closer. She didn't have to cut me off. Daddy Pig has arrived at Grandad Dog's garage. Oh, that's it. I can't go on. Daddy has stopped. Oh! You look rather hot. You need something to cool you down and give you energy. That's nice. Huh? A wasp? Shoo! Shoo! Get away, you little pest! The wasp wants to share Daddy Pig's ice lolly. No! This is my lolly! Daddy started running again! Really fast! Hooray! Oh. You can stop now, Daddy Pig, we have enough money to fix the school roof. Oh! Daddy Pig uh, has lost the wasp. Well done, Daddy Pig. All that extra running means we've got enough money for a new school bus too. Thank you, Daddy. Oh, oh, you're most welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy Pig is stupid. <laughs> Daddy, what's that shit? It's my football shirt. Daddy's playing football this afternoon. <laughs> but first, I have to go to work. See you later. Bye. Daddy Pig is going to leave Pepper for some milk. Poor Daddy. <laughs> I never like Daddy anyway. Come on, let's sh Yes, let's sh <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear. Mummy, we splashed 
Daddy's football shirt with Oh. Don't worry. We'll just wash it. <laughs> It'll be washed in no time and Daddy won't know it was ever muddy. <laughs> Let's find some more things to put in the machine. <laughs> Ami Pig and George have found more things to wash. Very good, George. <laughs> we put the clothes in here and then we switch it on. Hello, everyone. Prank them, John. <laughs> you already know. Hello, Daddy. Uh, Daddy Pig, we've got a bit of a problem and... Um... <laughs> Tell me later, Mummy Pig. I've got to get ready for football. Now, where's my football shirt? Here. But I can't wear a pink football shirt. Why not, Daddy? Pink is a disgusting colour. Hmm. What do you think, George? Yuck! George does not like... like, like, pink. Here are Daddy Pig's friends. FBI, open up! Oh, dear. George's multiple years of domestic terrorism felonies have finally caught up to him. My team are in white. I need a white shirt. But, Daddy, you have a white shirt. Just take off your jacket. See? Fantastic! Thank you, Pepper. <laughs> Hello, everyone. <laughs> Very smart. Thank you. Come on, let's play football! Yes! Go! Hooray! Hooray! Daddy, you've made your shirt all shitty. <laughs> of course, Pepper. Football shirts are meant. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy Pig loves playing football. Everyone loves playing football. Are you sure about that? Especially when it's muddy. <laughs> Win a trip to Hollywood to star in my new film, Vegetables in Space. Just find the golden ticket to win the trip of a lifetime to America! Mummy Pig is making bacon for lunch. Mummy, can we find Super Potato's golden ticket, please? Well, there's only one ticket in the whole world. So we'd have to be very lucky to find it. Oh, what's this in the potato? It's the golden ticket! <gasps> Yes, it means we're going to America! America! Pepper and her family are flying to America. Miss Rabbit is the pilot. This is your captain speaking. We'll soon be arriving in America, I think. Does anyone know where it is? I've never been before. You can't miss it. It's really big. Is that it? Yes, ma'am. We are. Holy good. We're coming. Welcome to America. <laughs> Miss Rabbit at your service. Where do you want to go? Rabbit? Sure. But this is Miss Rabbit. Every town needs a Miss Rabbit. That's right. Bye. <gasps> is this Hollywood? Hollywood? No! This is New York. Hop in. I'll give you the tour. <laughs> <laughs> New York, the city that never sleeps. Do you never sleep? Well, yeah. First stop of the tour, the 
Empire State Building! Wow. wow! Can we go to the top? Oh, I can't look. Daddy Pig does not like heights. But there's so much to see, Daddy. Oh, dear. Peppa wants to jump off of the Empire State Building. Yes! With this telescope, you can see even more. I can see a big green lady with an ice cream. That's the Statue of Liberty. Look at me. I miss a Statue of Liberty. <laughs> Come on, people. we got to get moving. Oh, going already? Where are we going next, Miss Rabbit? Times Square. There must be a million light bulbs here. It's the most light bulbiest square in all the world. Oh, look! There's Super Potato! Coming! Coming soon, the new movie from Super Potato and Ash Brown, Vegetables in Space! That's a movie we're going to be in! Really? Well then you better get straight to Hollywood! Yes, can you take us? I'm afraid not, but I have just the thing to get you there. A home! What's a home? It's just like a house. Here are your keys. Do you want to come? Peppa and her family are in America, on their way to Hollywood. I love this motorhome. <laughs> a motorhome is a house that you can drive. Are we in Hollywood yet, Daddy Pig? Let's ask someone. Hello. Hello. Bye. Well, howdy, folks. I'm Miss Rabbit. Oh, it's another, another, another Miss Rabbit. Yep, there's a lot of us around. Can I do you... Why don't you just settle down and get some of that good old in your belly? Well, I suppose we could stop. Mmm, eggy! <laughs> Thank you. That was delicious. Now I'll just sit back, relax, and... So, who likes dancing? Good! Then y'all come... Meet Mr. Bob Bobcat and his band. Oh, it's desert for miles and miles and miles. So, which way is Hollywood, please? That way. Thank, Thank you. you. The desert is going on for miles and miles and miles and miles. Are we nearly there yet? <laughs> no, not yet, Pepper. I'm not Mr. Buffalo. I'm Mr. Bison. Ah. Oh. Are you digging up the road? No, miss. This here is a canyon. Ooh, that's a big hole. Yes, it is. 277 miles long. One mile Wow! If y'all want to know more, there's an information desk over there. Hey, how you doing? I'm Miss Rabbit. Oh, it's another Miss Rabbit! Yeah, there's a lot of us about. Would you like a tour of the camp? Yes, yes please. please! Then hop in. <laughs> <laughs> there aren't any dinosaurs now, but many wonderful animals live in the canyon. There's an eagle. Wow. wow! Okay. Just watch out for the rapids. Yes, lots of fun. Look, caves! Diamond! Ah! Wow, I would 
would love to be in a movie with Hash Brown. You can come. I don't know. Let's stop and look at the map. Sir, did you know that you may only stop on a freeway if it is an emergency? But... Oh! Well, in that case, just hang a right, and then you head straight on until you see... George has seen... George... And another... George... Oh. Am I a bird? Am I a plane? No! I'm a potato! And I am... Hash Brown. You suck! And I'm Peppa Pig. We won a ticket to be in your movie. Vegetables in space. Then let's get to the studio. That's right. Time to put on your costumes. Peppa and her family are dressed up as broccoli. She didn't have to cut me off. <laughs> you look funny, Mummy Broccoli. Oh, wow! So do you, Pepper Broccoli. Shh! No talking on set. We are about to start filming my movie, Vegetables in Space. Lights. Camera. Action! Attention! The galaxy is being taken over by a bunch of naughty carrots. Not the carrots! Yes, the naughty carrot bunch. The naughty carrots will destroy the universe! If only there was some way of getting rid of them! What do we do? How are you going to save the day, Super Potato? Miss Rabbit, 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 and Miss Rabbit. Hooray! It's the Miss Rabbit! We decided to take the day off for a change. We couldn't miss Hash Brown. He's our favorite potato starch based movie star. You're too kind. You suck. Uh, could you help us save the universe? Magic. Look, it's all Miss Mmm, yummy. We did it! The universe is saved! Magic. I'm here to take you home. <laughs> Have you had a good time in America, Peppa? No. The Pepper has had a wonderful time in America. <laughs> Pepper and George are playing in their bedroom. Dinosaur. George, you must stay on your side of the bedroom. That's your side, and this is the scene. The arseholes to your side on my side. The arseholes to the your side and do not cross the invisible line. FBI, open up! Help! Help! Peter. The horse is here. 
Hello, Mr. Hi. Hello, Daddy. I've got some letters for you. Is there anything for me and George? <laughs> hmm. I'm afraid not. There's a parcel as well. Probably that box of reinforced concrete I ordered. All the stamps on it. That's because it's from a long way away 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 Oh, the label says it is for Pepper and George. Look, Mummy, a parcel for George and me. Ooh. There's a letter too. <laughs> Love from your Auntie Dotty. Auntie Dotty lives far away in another country. Ooh, what is the present? <laughs> it's got wheels. Car. It's got legs. It's a table. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a tail. Oh. Tables don't have tails. You didn't have to cut me off. There's a handle as well. What can it be? There's something else in the box. It's a toy hawk. I shall call it Twinkle Toes. Horsey, twinkle toes. Horsey, twinkle toes. Horsey. Remember, children, Aunt Dotty sent the present for both of you. You'll have to share. Share is caring. Can I play with twinkle toes first? Let George have the first turn. He's the youngest. <laughs> horsey, horsey. <laughs> George likes playing with horsey. It is called Twinkle Toes, not Horsey. And now it's Peppa's turn. I am Princess Peppa with my magic horse, Twinkle Toes. Peppa likes playing with Twinkle Toes. Whoops! Perhaps you should play with the toy hall outside. Yes, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, it's a bit steep here. Maybe you should play at the bottom of the hill. And the quickest way down the hill is to ride down. Are you sure, Daddy? Don't crash like you always do. Oh, oh, I know what I'm doing, Peppa. I'm a grown-up. Yeah! Are you sure about that? How are you going to stop, Daddy? Uh, I don't know. Where are the brakes? Peter. The horse is here. What was that big splash? What big splash? Daddy Pig, did you know you've got a duck on your head? Oh, uh, yes. Well, I did fall in the pond. <laughs> horsey, horsey. George wants to ride on the horse. Go, go. Oh. George cannot make the horse go. She didn't have to cut me off. If only there was someone big and strong to push George along. I'm big and strong. Horsey, <laughs> <laughs> horsey. Pepper and George love playing together with horse. This is Mummy Pig. Oh! And this is Daddy Pig. Oh. <laughs> Susie Shrek has come to play with Pepper and George. <laughs> Pepper and Susie are having a tea party. <laughs> Magic. Magic. 
magic. <laughs> George is playing with Mr. Dinosaur. Dinosaur! Grrr. <laughs> George likes playing with Mr. Dinosaur. Oh. Oh dear. George has shot it. What's that smell? <laughs> it was me. Potty George. Too late for the potty. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. <sighs> oh yes. Does Teddy want more tea? Of course. Teddy likes lots of tea. <whistles> Mummy? <coughs> Why can't George go to the toilet like me? George is too little for the toilet, Pepper. He is potty training. <laughs> hmm. He is not very good at potty training. <laughs> he will get better, Pepper. You were just the same once. What? <coughs> I never did potty training. Or me. <laughs> we all did potty training when we were little, Pepper. Even mummies and daddies. Now I remember sitting on the potty like this. <laughs> <laughs> so, George, next time, before you poo-poo or wee-wee, call the magic word potty. Potty! That's right, potty! Let's play giants! <laughs> <laughs> Has shot it. Next time, George, you must do the shouting out. Call the magic word potty. Potty. Oh, oh. <laughs> How high can you throw the pepper? The ball. Catch the ball, George. <laughs> George, do you need the? Love charting. <laughs> Everybody loves body training. What does this say? I can't read. It is a lovely autumn day. We're going to have a pumpkin party, and all your friends are invited. Hooray! We'll start by making legalized nuclear bombs. <laughs> no. Mummy Pig has a lot of important work to do. Pepper and George can scoop out the inside. <laughs> we use the insides to make my special pumpkin pie. And the outside to make a legalized nuclear bomb. Lovely. Pepper is dressing up as a witch. Do I look witchy? Very witchy. You need to do some cackling. What's cackling? <laughs> Very good cackling. <laughs> George is dressing up as a dinosaur. Dinosaur. Grrr. Oh, oh, scary. Oh, 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 shiver my timbers. Shut up, man. FBI, open up. Ah! <laughs> 
Rebecca and Richard Rabbit are here with Mr Rabbit. Oh, has the party started yet? No. Hello, I'm a bitch. <laughs> George is a diaper. What are you? I'm a carrot. Gone bad. <laughs> no. And Richard is a monster carrot. Uh. Is that what a monster looks like? Yes. Let's go and get the others for the party. This is Susie Sheep's house. <laughs> oh, oh, scary. Oh, 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 shiver my timbers. Shut up, man. We've come to get Susie for the pumpkin party. <laughs> I'm a beautiful vampire. <laughs> What's a vampire? You stupid. No, no. What's 9 plus 10? 21. You stupid. Let's get the others. This is Pedro Pony's house. <laughs> Very scary. Is Pedro ready? Yes. <laughs> what scary thing are you dressed as, Pedro? I'm a soup. Supers aren't scary. I'm a scary soup. Oh. oh. Nobody likes Pedro. Oh. What was that? Sounds like a furry. Hello, everyone. It's Dan. Emily and Edmund Elephant are here too. What are you, Emily? I'm an A. Edmund is a ghost. No, I'm a paranormal apparition. Boy, have you Shut your s. It's a clever clogs ghost. <laughs> <laughs> here is Candy Cat. I'm a bitch. You can't be the bitch. I'm the bitch. I'll turn you into a frog. <laughs> To a frog. <laughs> if you turn each other into frogs, you won't be able to go to the party. <laughs> Everyone back to our. <laughs> I'm a vampire. What's nine plus ten? Twenty-one. You stupid. That's odd. Madame Gazelle doesn't have a reflection in the mirror. Dressing up! There are lanterns! But best of all... It is raining today. So Peppa and George cannot play outside. Magic. Daddy, it stopped raining. Can we go out to play? <laughs> no. Run along, you two. <laughs> Pepper loves jumping in muddy puddles. I love muddy puddles. <laughs> Peppa? If you jump in muddy puddles, you must wear your boots. Sorry, Mummy. George likes pepper. No. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. George, if you jump in muddy puddles, you must wear your boots. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Pepper likes to bully her little brother, George. Look, 
George? George wants to jump into the big puddle first. I believe I can fly. <coughs> Stop, George. Boy, if you don't... Oh dear, Pepper's shouted. George loved jumping in muddy puddles. Goodness me! Daddy, Daddy! Guess what we've been doing? Let me think. Have you been watching television? No. Have you just had a bath? <laughs> <laughs> I know. You've been jumping in muddy puddles. Yes, yes, Daddy. We've been jumping in muddy puddles. Ho, oh, oh. ho. And look at the mess you're in. Let's clean up quickly before Mummy sees the mess. When we've cleaned up, will you and Mummy come? <laughs> Pig, look at the mess you're in. <laughs> it is bedtime. Good night, George. Good night, Pepper. Can I have a stop? Okay. I'll read you D's big nuts. But we all have that one. D was a squirrel who had big nuts. His nutsack was so big that it would drag on the ground everywhere he went. Uh, yes, that is what happens. Can we choose another story? Susie likes to look at balls. Do you want to play with my balls? Mummy's giant melons. Oh, what's this one? The wonderful world of co- I've been looking for that. Is it your book, Daddy? It is bedtime. Book I borrowed from the library. What's a library? You stupid. Daddy Pig has forgotten to take this book back. You stupid. It's not much of a story, Peppa. Please read it, Daddy. OK. <laughs> it is bedtime. You must be quiet in the library. No. Wow! What a lot of chickens! Why? Because people come here. Why is the computer beeping? <laughs> Don't worry, Daddy. Pig. <laughs> Look what I found. Further adventures in the world of co Here's a book. No. D's Big Nuts. It's boring. But this is a different story. It might be more fun. I bet it's not. It is morning. Once upon a time, there was a... <coughs> that was a busy day. The end. Chloe's Big Pepper and her family are stupid. I love playing with big c <laughs> <laughs> These are my friends, Simon Squirrel and Belinda Bear. I ain't reading all that. You can call me Cy. It's short for Simon. She didn't have to cut me off. And I'm B. You like jazz? I'm Pepper. We'll call you Pep. Oh. And this is George. We'll call you Ja. She didn't have to cut me off. Oh. You didn't tell us you had baby cousins, Chloe. <laughs> George, I can see your wiggly tail. 
Top 5 Scariest Humscares. Número 5. Where's everyone gone? We don't like children's music. <laughs> What music are you into? I like this. It's very grown up. Shut your sp You will see Chloe again soon. I'm coming to your house next week, Peppa. <laughs> Playing games. It is bedtime. Just hear those sleeping jingle ling a ring a ting a ting a ling a too. Peppa's Christmas. It is Christmas Eve. Peppa and George are going to post their letters to Father Christmas. Here are Peppa's friends. George has asked for a <laughs> And I would love a chicken sandwich. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Is everybody ready? No. Then let's. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Bye. Want a Christmas tree? No. Hello, everyone. <coughs> big tree, this one. Got a big c. Uh, no. See, See you later. later. See you later. <laughs> Bye. Daddy's been gone for ages. I hope our tree is okay. <laughs> What's that noise? Uh, it's Daddy! Uh, Where's our tree? Uh, Hooray! Uh, uh, Daddy, was the tree heavy? I hope the tree fits in our house. Don't worry. I'll make sure it fits. There. Sticking out your guy at for the Rizzler. You're so skeeby dee. <laughs> what a charming song. You're so phantom tax. Lovely, Pepper. Now it's time to. Wait, there's more. I just want to be your Sigma. Give me your Ohio. <laughs> Maybe that's enough singing. <laughs> Here's a little snack for Father Christmas. Daddy, why does Father Christmas come down the chimney? Why doesn't he just use the front door? Father Christmas won't come unless you're asleep in bed. George, let's... George is asleep. Well, I'm going to stay wide awake. Peppa is asleep. What was that? Flying past the window. And what was that noise? George, there's a loud banging noise coming from the roof. It is Father Christmas. Pepper wants a chicken sandwich. George wants a... George, it's Father Christmas. Ah, hello there. And who might you be? My name is Jeff. And who is this very smart young gentleman? My name is Walter Hartwell White. I live at 308 Negra Arroyo Lane, Albuquerque, New Mexico, 87104. It's only George. <laughs> Please to meet you, George. <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> Wake up, Pepper and George. No. George has a toy train. And Pepper has... They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. All of Pepper's friends are here. I got us.
<laughs> Happy Christmas, Peppa! <laughs> Two thousand years later. It is the night before Christmas at Peppa's house. George fell asleep. Daddy fell asleep. Granny and Grandpa are here too. And they're asleep. Who is that? Ho, 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 It is Freddy Fezbear. My last delivery. Tomorrow. It is very early in the morning. Come on, George. No. <laughs> George are excited it's Christmas. Everyone is excited it's Christmas. Who's that big present for? It says Grandpa Pig. Open it, Grandpa. <laughs> oh, that's just what I wanted. It's a drone. I don't really like the word drone. I prefer to call it a legalized nuclear bomb. What does it do, Grandpa? I said a boom, chicka boom. Watch this. The drone can fly. She didn't have to cut me off. Like Here is Mrs. Duck. Boy, if you don't. Hello, it's me, Peppa. <laughs> <laughs> What's that noise? Bomb has been planted. Peppa and her family are having Christmas lunch. <laughs> Losing your present, Grandpa. Well, it was fun while it lasted. FBI, open up! Father Christmas! Children. What the dog doing? Today we celebrate Chinese New Year. Um, excuse me, what's the actual f It is when we come in the Hello, Madam Gazelle! Put them on the next hill, please, Mr. Bull. No. Before we celebrate Chinese New Year, we must why? Amogus. Madam Gazelle? No. Okay. When you have good luck, nice things happen. She didn't have to cut me off. They say if you wear something red, it will bring you good luck. I'm wearing lucky red shoes. I'm wearing a red hat. George is Russia. <laughs> ah, a red scarf and a red dress? That will make you extra lucky, Peppa. That's not fair. I want to be extra lucky too. If I am extra lucky, I will share it with you, Susie. No. Now, to celebrate the new year, we will have a dragon dance with a big dragon like this. Ooh, is it a scary dragon? Yes. Where is it? We are going to eat it. <laughs> it looks like a sausage. It might look like a sausage now, but soon it will be a magnificent dragon. How do we make the sausage? With your imagination. Oh, that reminds me. Your phone ringing. Your phone ringing. Big boy, come pick up your phone. Why you no pick up your phone? Your phone ringing. Oh, yes. Daddy, son. Who wants to carry the dragon? Mine, 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 mine. Who wants to carry a lantern? Mine, 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 mine. Who wants to bang a cymbal or a drum? Mine, 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 mine. I have made a lion costume. 
to lead the dragon dance. Ooh. But who's going to be the lion? Are here parents of the dragon dance to see parents of Wow, this is amazing. No. Oh, the fireworks! I almost forgot. Oh dear, Mr. Ball has pressed the wrong button. Practical nuke! Incoming! a lovely firework display. Hang on, there's more than that. <laughs> Grumpy Rabbit's Jurassic Park. Today is Freddy Fofer's Bear's <laughs> birthday. Where are we going for your birthday, Freddy? Jurassic Park. But I can't wait to get there. We're here! <laughs> Welcome to Jurassic Park. Dinosaur. <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. Dinosaurs loves George. Are there really dinosaurs here? Yes. You. Edmund knows a lot about dinosaurs. He is a nerd. But we've got better than real dinosaurs. We've got singing dinosaurs. We're no strangers to love. <laughs> <laughs> They're a bit small. Ah, yes. We do have a big dinosaur. A real whopper. Through the cave! <laughs> oh, the footprints have stopped. Look! Wow! It's a big dinosaur! Nom, nom, nom. Dinosaur slide! <laughs> that is some dinosaur. He's a brontosaurus. Actually. Right, my little explorers. Are you ready? No. We have to find Daddy Pig. I never liked Daddy anyway. Leave it to me. Freddy Fox has a very good sense of smell. No, it's better than real. Watch this. <laughs> the dinosaur egg has a box inside it. Oh, 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 oh. It's not a pretend cake, is it, Grumpy Rabbit? No, the cake is very real. <laughs> Birthday boy first. Here you go, Freddy. for a bit of song and dance. Everyone, copy me. I don't know. Pepper and her family are going to die. Daddy, what is a museum? It's a... It's a place full of interesting things that are 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 very old. Older than you? Yes, even older than me. There's one room full of room for. And there's another room with a real room. <laughs> Bye! 
How many tickets, please? Two adults. Dinosaur. Grrr. <laughs> and a dinosaur. <laughs> this is the Queen's special chair. It's called a chair. She didn't have to cut me off. Mummy, where is the Queen's television? They didn't have television then. <gasps> no television? But they did have computers. No, they didn't have computers either. What did they do all day? Joe Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Pepper imagines being a queen. Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Is there anything else you would... Yes, more cake please. Of course. Come on, everyone. Daddy, I'm Queen Pepper. You must bow when you speak to me. Oh. And what room is this? This is the dinosaur room. Actually, Pepper, he's very big. <gasps> <laughs> dinosaur. <laughs> George imagines being a big dinosaur. <laughs> the dinosaur room is George's favorite room. <laughs> My favorite room is. And it looks as if Daddy Pig is... Mummy Pig has been diagnosed with death. Daddy Pig's favourite room is the Museum Cafe. Oh, yes. This is... Elon Musk. Daddy Pig is getting some milk. Good. That's all the papers I need. Bye. Mummy, can we... No. What would you like to make? Dinosaur. Oh, George, you always say dinosaur for everything. Dinosaur. Let's make an air... George likes air. Can we make an aeroplane that flies? No. All we need is... We know where there's... <laughs> Here's some paper. Perfect. Mummy Pig is going to make a paper aeroplane. Fold the paper down the middle. <laughs> now fold the paper down the middle. <laughs> now fold the paper down the middle. <laughs> now fold the paper down the middle. <laughs> paper aeroplanes! <laughs> Let's see if they can fly. Ready, steady, go! Mummy Pig's aeroplane has flown. She didn't have to cut me off. Like My turn. Wee. Pepper's flower pot has landed in an aeroplane. Your turn, George. Wee. George's aeroplane is doing a loop the loop. And has landed in the flower pot. Make a big aeroplane. <laughs> Blue aeroplane made a big pepper and George. 
Hello, everyone. Shouldn't you be a everyone? Yes, but I've forgotten everyone. Daddy, we're making a daddy. We made a really big one. Wow, fantastic. You need someone big and strong to throw it. Ready? Steady? Go! Go! Hello? Magic. The big blue aeroplane is flying. She didn't have to cut me off. It just keeps on going. Bye bye, aeroplane. Oh dear. Oh, oh, bye bye. Now. I need to find my important work papers. Has anyone seen it? None. Is this one of your important papers? No. Is this one of your important papers, Daddy? Bomb has been planted. The only paper I'm missing now is a big blueprint. Hmm, is it blue? No. Maybe I should ring the office. This is the World Trade Center. Hello, Daddy Pig. Did you find the paper? No. I found some of them. Did you pray today? Did you pray today? That might be a problem. Oh, oh, oh. Threw it away! And it's blue and blue! Ah! It's here! It just landed on my desk! Hey? What a great idea to make us into a paper aeroplane and throw us to it! Oh, yes, well, I am a bit of an ex- Thank you, Daddy! Pig. Now the blueprint is delivered, Daddy Pig can take the sh Tiny creature, you our creatures, so sh Pepper and George are helping Grandpa Pig pick, pig, pick, pig, pick vegetables. Wow! <laughs> Here is a lettuce. You shut up. Oh, what's that? <laughs> There's a horrible and or a snormal for a hussy. Hey? Chocolate cake. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. that's not a chocolate cake. It's just a little lettuce. Hello, Mr. Snail. Hello, Mr. Snail. If I were a snail, I'd have a bed, and a bed, and a table, and a bed, and a bed, and a bed, and a chair, and a fridge, and a bed, and a television. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa, what do snails eat? Well, mostly they eat my vegetables. Oi, stop that, you... <laughs> Grandpa, George and I want to play cheeky snails. These baskets can be your sh. There, now you look like two cheese. And I'm going to eat our all Grandpa Pig's lettuce. Keep off my lovely lettuce, you cheese. And when Grandpa Pig shouts at me, <laughs> Hello, Grandpa Pig. Hello, Grandpa Pig. Hello, Susie. Hello, Grandpa Pig. Have you come? Hello, Hello Grandpa, Grandpa Pig. Pig. Will you shut up? 
Oh, oh, oh. Have you come to play with Peppa and George? Have you come? Yes. I don't know where they are. <laughs> it's just me and these two cucumber. We achieve me Pretending to be chocolate cake. <laughs> Can we be snails too? No. Something from the garden. A carrot. Rebecca Rabbit likes carrots. Carrots. No. Come over here. What's that buzzing sound? It's coming from that little house. Grandpa, why is that doll's house making a fire? That's not a doll's house, Peppa. It's a doll's house. It's called a house. Look, here's one. <gasps> Delicious. What's she doing? In a honey game, we are having a real fish in there. Hey? Honey, let's pretend to be bees. Yes, let's be bees. Bye. What busy bean chilling? Yes, we bean chilling. <laughs> Goodness me! What do we have here? What do we have here? Granny, we. What do we have here? <laughs> we busy bees. And what would you like on your toast? Some tomatoes. That's lucky, because that's what I've made. Spike! I like being a bee, 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 because they eat lots of lovely tomatoes. I like being a snail, because they eat chocolate cake. <laughs> Oi! Oh. You cheeks! <laughs> <laughs> It is the day of the school fate. Miss Rabbit is stupid. Chicken sandwich. The blue ticket wins. A guitar. Well done, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have a ticket, please? No. Peppa, what are you hoping to win? Um, excuse me, what the actual f Wouldn't it be nicer to win the homemade chocolate cake? Daddy Pig is a fatty. The red ticket wins. Psych! That's the wrong number! Oh! I'll put a whole bag of jelly beans up my... Four, please. What the hell? Aunt Freddy! Oh, 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 oh. Dinosaur! Oh, and a teddy, and a dinosaur, and a dinosaur, and a dinosaur, and a di Tomatoes, spaghetti, onions. 
That makes sense. <laughs> Hurry up, Daddy Pig. No. Nah. Hurry up, Daddy Pig. <laughs> All right. Very impressive, Miss Rabbit. You must be an expert chocolate cake. Not really. This is the first time I've ever flown a cucumber. Oh. Hold tight. Rabbit heats up the air in the balloon to make it rise into the sky. <laughs> Would anyone like to do the map reading? I'm very good at map reading. Are you sure about that? Oh, this map is a bit difficult. It was if I am sick. Shall we go higher? <laughs> no. Yes, please. Higher, higher. <gasps> Hooray! The balloon is rising high into the sky. <laughs> Don't worry, Pepper. We're just flying. Ooh. Wow! The sky is back again. Look, Teddy. We're flying really high. Wow! Pepper, be careful you don't. Help me! Drop. Teddy! Flying high. Sky. We're going down. Miss Rabbit is making the balloon go down. She didn't have to cut me off. I can't see Teddy anywhere. Silly Daddy, your tummy is too big. I can use this anchor to rest Teddy. Slowly. 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 Now. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. Teddy! Hooray! Hooray! Now. <laughs> oh dear. No one is looking where they are going. Look out! Hold tight! It's time to start! Oh. In a tree. Daddy Pig, do you know where we are? Uh, nah. You, you idiot. We're lost, aren't we? Yes. Look, everyone. Yes, we must be Grandpa Pig. As I thought. Goodness me! Rate my outfit 1 to 10. Uh, help! Please! Hit the follow button for more. Help! Please! Grandpa! We can't get down! Finish the lyrics. I don't give a sh Granny! Grandpa! I will burn this planet down. How very exciting! I'm afraid the most exciting thing we can offer is a piece of my homemade... Bah. Homemade chocolate cake? That is exciting. Fatty. <laughs> that was the best balloon ride ever. I'm joking. And that was the best... Cucumber? Ever. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs>